Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com with some soccer. 21-22 tops finest UEFA Champions League soccer. Four box, random team break number six, the second half of the case that we popped open. And we're giving away five spots. So it's a 20 spot break, but we only sold 15 spots outright. We're gonna randomize those 15 names. Here they are. We're gonna randomize those 15 names and top five will get uh, extra spots. So a little buy one, get one scenario is a possibility here. Let's roll it, randomize it six into two, five times. Six and two, eight times to the top five, that is. One, two, three, four, five, six. Good luck. Seven and eighth and final time. After eight, Jordan, Jordan, Kennard, Ryan R, Ryan C. Congrats to you. After eight times, extra spots going your way. We'll put those little rooftop symbols there so you know you won those spots. Now, let's assign you a Champions League club. There are the clubs right there. There are all the names right there. Let's roll it, randomize it. Five and a four, nine times for names and teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. After nine, we got Richard down to Ryan C. Uh, five and a four, nine times for the clubs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and once more, ninth and final time. We've got Wolfsburg and Sevilla combo down to my club, Liverpool. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm pretty sure that we're, we're going to be taking a strong position on a World Cup product this year. So soccer fans, gear up, get ready. Richard with the combo, Wolfsburg and uh, Sevilla. Brian with Barcelona, nice. Jordan with Bruges and Lille. Porto and the Salzburg combo and Inter Milan. Ryan R with Juventus. Canard with Atletico Madrid. Jordan with Chelsea and Man United. Cody with Man City, last spot mojo. Eaton, Matt Eaton with PSG, Paris Saint-Germain. Canard with Real Madrid. Ryan R with Leipzig. Jordan with AC Milan, so you've got both of the Milanese teams. Matthew with Ajax. Ryan with Sporting Club de Portugal. Ryan R with Borussia Dortmund. Carlos with Atalanta. Adam with Bayern Munich. And Ryan with my club, Liverpool. LFC. All right, let's alphabetize by team. And we're going to pause the video and see if there's any trades. When we come back, we'll see if there's any trades. And then we'll have the break. Stick around. BRB. All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. No deals were done here in this break. Random team number six, second half of the case that we popped open. And away we go. Uh, and I marked all those number six so you know they're from the same case. Oliver's not so sure. You think Kimbrough has time to figure it out? I don't know. I don't know if I have that, that faith in Kimbrough like you do, Oliver. But yeah, Dodgers, Dodgers do have some options, so that is, that is nice. I don't think Dustin May is going to... Do you think he's going to close? Maybe. But I feel like during his rehab starts, he was he was intentionally stretched out to be a... Uh, stretched out to be a starter. I think it's actually more likely to see Kershaw as a, as a sort of late-inning guy or closer. As crazy as that sounds. Because I don't know when he's coming back and how much time you'll have to get stretched back out for, for starts. And Kershaw certainly has the mentality to, to show up at, uh, at any part 
of the game. Out of 250, Jaden Sancho scoring a nice goal against my club, Liverpool. This goes to Jordan and Man United. Your closer is Evan Phillips. I, I do like Evan Phillips. Kershaw, too dramatic a choice? I mean, I don't think he's going to be, like, a choice per se. But if the, it's like one of those, like, I don't think Dave Roberts is going to say Kershaw's our closer this postseason. But I, I could see him sort of using him as a surprise and being like, oh, yeah. The, uh, the, the situation called for it. We've got a rookie auto. Yasko uh, Vardial, Gavardial for Leipzig. That's going to be for Ryan Redmond. Uh, Leipzig, that's for Ryan Redmond. We've got a Cole Palmer, Man City rookie. And uh, Armindo Seed to 199 for Bayern Munich. So that is for Adam. And who has Man City? Cody of Man City. Urias May Gonsolin, Kershaw. What do, what do we do with Tyler Anderson? Has he not, does he not deserve a start? Anderson, your long guy. Gotcha. All right. It's Phil Foden, purple to two ninety nine. And we got the Barca keeper, Mark Andre Ter Stegen, for Barcelona. That'll be going to Brian Heyman. There you go, Brian. Ooh, Mike likes the idea of Bobby Miller. I don't, I don't know. If he gets a cup of coffee in September and looks great, it could be interesting to see if he makes a postseason roster, maybe if there's an injury somewhere. Christian Pulisic for Chelsea. Jordan with Chelsea. Christian Pulisic looking to move away from Chelsea is the latest rumor. Does he go out on loan somewhere? Does he... I don't think he'll be... I don't know. There could be a transfer. I think the... I think the transfer window is still open till the end of the end of the month. So there could be a little movement there. Let's see what happens. Yeah, he'll definitely get a call up, right? But I mean, how is he going to get starts? You think? Maybe to set the rotation for the playoffs. Maybe they'll 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 give him a spot start here and there. Get Pepio some more starts too. But I don't know. I mean, if if Kershaw doesn't, you know, his if his back issue keeps him out a little bit longer. If he doesn't have too much time to get stretched out for some starts. I could certainly, I can certainly see Kershaw being used in uh, some high leverage situations or closing situations if necessary. Might not be the first option, but there can be some times there. Maybe if some closers are used the day before or something like that. Bobby Miller's from the town over from me, says Ryan Met Redman. He's a beast. Uh, that's what I hear. Well, Oliver, yeah, Bobby Miller's more next year guy, but I don't know. You know, you, you always think, you always see like uh, the old K Rod story and for the Angels back in the day, and it's possible. But hey, if there is a rotation spot, maybe two open, maybe a few open next year for guys like for guys like Bobby Miller and Pepio. There is Anthony Alanga for Manchester United. That'll be for Jordan. 
That's a 250. And for Bayern Munich, we got Christopher Stott, a rookie refractor. You know, and a youngster right here. Hold on to that one. And we've got a Edouard Mouchut autograph for PSG. That's going to go to Matt. Virgil van Dyke, tough day for the for uh, for Liverpool against Man United. There's Alfonso Davies to two ninety nine for Bayern Munich, and a Luis Muriel to seventy five. That's for uh, for Atalanta. That's going to go to Carlos. And Atalanta, Finest Futures rookie card. Gavi, not Javi, but Gavi for Barcelona. And that's for Brian. And the Davies goes to, goes to Adam W. and Bayern Munich. And we got Pedro Gonçalves for Sporting Clube de Portugal. I don't think I've seen this parallel here. 63 out of 99. Maybe just not that background color. Look or maybe just wave and then the background color. Anyway, um, that'll be for Ryan C. Got a lava parallel coming up behind Neymar. It's Robert Lewandowski to 199. That is still uh, Bayern Munich edition. Hey, what up, Jason Jaspi? Jason says he'll be live at 11 a.m. Nice, for new release day. So pre-order now, jaspiescasebreaks.com, and join Jason at 11 a.m. Pacific time. We got Centurions, Tony Cruz, and Nuno Mendes, Finest Futures Rookie Refractor for PSG. That's for Matt. All right, next. Yeah, I think I did hear about that. I didn't realize he went to Miracosta, but I knew that he, he went to high school out here in the South Bay. Did he get drafted by the Dodgers? Is it the Dodgers system? Heard a little buzz about him. Oh, he was drafted by the Don. Nice. Oliver's in the South Bay area. Oliver, what do you know about Jared Caros? Oh, hurt, hurt all last year at UCLA. Interesting. 16th round, all right. That would be cool to see uh, to see Carol's come up. All right, third box. And we've got Sven Boatman for Lille. Jordan Ashton with the uh, Bruges Lille combo. Trading says he was a uh, he was buddies with Jared Karros's brother, also at UCLA. Forty-four out of one twenty-five. We were just talking about this kid, Sidney Raviger. Rookie Hyper Parallel for Ryan Redmond and Leipzig. 44 out of 125. 
Yeah, man, they got him at 15. There's Pierre Kalulu, rookie refractor. And Cole Palmer for Man City to 299. That's going to go to Cody in Man City. And the Kalulu, AC Milan, Jordan. So, what is that Rayburger? What's that hyper parallel going for on a secondary market? Someone look that up. Let's get an idea of how big that card is. There's Clement Lenglet. Lenglet. For Barca, autograph for Brian. Another Robert Lewandowski for Bayern Munich to 175. Speckle, parallel. And there's Jude Bellingham, Finest Futures Refractor for Borussia Dortmund. Ryan, possible possible future uh, Liverpool midfielder. After using, losing Erlen Holland in this summer transfer window, I don't think they were going to move Jude Bellingham, but maybe, maybe he possibly goes next summer. But there'll be some competition for his signature, of course. So the out of 99, Tradiac saying looking like... 20, 25 bucks, but he has, you have out of 50, that's a, with offers for over 200 bucks. I guess it does make that big of a difference. Still, still nice. Yeah, uh, I don't think yeah, I don't think anyone's gonna pay one sixty, but you know, but they'll get a lot. You know, Liverpool certainly need to refresh that midfield a little bit. I know, I know, Chelsea has taught. I mean, he's being linked to a lot of teams because he's Jude Bellingham, but. But Liverpool supporters seem to think it's a foregone conclusion that, that he's going to end up in a Liverpool shirt. But, but I personally, as a Liverpool supporter, I don't think that's the case. Does he go earlier? Maybe if Borussia Dortmund have, have a bad season, maybe he goes in, in the January window. But that would be a hefty price, though. All right, we got another hyper, Sandro Tonali. 10 out of 125. And we got Riven Gravenberg for Ajax. It's going to go to Matthew Wood. All right, that's that's how it usually works, Tradiac. As his account or as his contract runs out, his price will decrease. That's true. That's obvious. And then we'll see what that price really ends up being at. We'll see. All right, we got Hannibal, Finest Futures rookie from Man United, Jordan Ashton. Been hearing a lot about him, a lot of hype around him. And Giggs in court. There's Hannibal again, rookie refractor for Man United. Jordan. I think Sané and Mane scored for Munich over in their last game. There's Cole Palmer to 99. That's for Man City. And there is 
Uh, Maxence Lacroix for Wolfsburg. That'll be for Richard. Getting the autograph. Yeah, that is a bit of a shame. That's 19 out of 25, by the way, Richard. The the, the growing perception that that uh, or the perception that Dortmund is just a feeder club. Yeah, you're making some good profits though, but at some point we gotta try to try to battle that uh, that Bayern Munich dominance. Phil Foden speckle to 175 for Man City. That's for Cody. We got a Sydney Rabiger rookie card. Maybe if this grades out nicely, that could be nice. Keep an eye out on him, Ryan Redman, and Leipzig, and prized footballers with a little uh, color blast in the background there. I feel like that's that's different from the other parallels, right? Anyway, still looks nice. Chelsea. That'll be for Jordan. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Another four boxes in the store, and that's from a fresh case. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Hey, uh, we're going to be breaking all this footy all year long, the rest of the year long and beyond, but with, with, the, uh, with the World Cup coming up, good time to get into that saw. Oh, nice. Trey Deck and Stevie saying that's a case hit. Oh, okay, great. Ron Jordan, case hit. I knew it was different. Thanks, everybody. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.